So, so far we have everything working out perfectly for us. The next thing we're going to do is to actually run a command in our command prompt that will create these, um, these um, fields in our database. All right. So let's go to our command prompt and um, here we'll run php artisan migrate. If you run this on a normal day, it should create the tables following the instructions you have in your migration file. But the problem we have right now is that we've already, the tables already exist. Some of the tables, for instance, the user and the password tables already exist. If we go to a database and take a look, you see that um, we'll come here on the referral. They, uh, some tables, you see migrations, password, reset, and users, they already exist. So we need to create a table. We need to, we need to um, run this migration in such a way that, um, it will force create you understand so if you do colon refresh in some versions of laravel if you do colon refresh it will work in some other versions if you do colon fresh it will work so it depends on what you want fresh or refresh or whatever works for you so i hit on this refresh works for me luckily all right so we're good you see it has rolled back first thing it did was roll back four migrations then um create new ones beautiful so if we go to our database right now and click on this Keep your eye here. You see that we have three tables here. But if we click on this, you see that we have more now. Beautiful. This is awesome. So let's see in the next video. All right.